This is the epicentre of what has become a major police investigation here on the outskirts of Glasgow over the course of this morning. This is the home of Peter Murrell, the home of Nicola Sturgeon, the power couple in Scottish politics until just last week. We understand, according to one neighbour here, that Nicola Sturgeon left this property just after 8 o'clock this morning, 20 minutes or so before this police uh, cordon was put up, this tent was erected. Of course, that's usually reserved for major police investigations. Let's give you a sense as to the scale of this uh, inquiry and we'll walk down the street. Of course, there are a number of police vehicles here and with inside. The occupants are not there, the detectives are. There is the windows closed, the blinds are closed and the curtains too. The front room there is shielded by a police barrier and within that blue tent is where the evidence is being gathered. Uh, this is an investigation that is centred on the SNP's finances and its fundraising. Uh, discussions over the course of the last couple of years here in Scotland around a loan that Peter Murrell apparently gave to the SNP uh, over the course of the last couple of years and also questions around £600,000 of finances that were raised for the cause of a second Scottish independence referendum. Well, in the last hour or so, we can see the garage there of Peter Murrell, the garage of Nicola Sturgeon. It is now closed, but we can tell you that there has been a hive of police activity within that garage. Uh, photos have been taken items have been screened and removed and I can also tell you that within this blue tent here just behind where these officers are standing there is what appears to be a white vehicle so what is within that tent well that is what detectives are examining and all the while uh, Peter Murrell the 58 year old former chief executive of the SNP a man who was at the helm of the Scottish National Party for more than two decades, well, he resigned just a number of weeks ago after a huge controversy surrounding membership numbers. 30,000 members left the SNP over the course of the last 18 months. There were suggestions that the party tried to cover up those dwindling numbers, and he resigned fairly suddenly, and it was a shock resignation at the same time that his wife, Nicola Sturgeon, departed the highest office in the land after 3,000 days at the top. Nicola Sturgeon was clear during questions by Sky News in recent weeks, one of her final interviews in office. She was asked specifically whether she or her husband had been interviewed as part of this police investigation, and she said no at that point. Well, that has changed today. Peter Murrell is no longer in this house. He is facing a barrage of questions from detectives as this investigation gathers pace.